Isn't it fascinating? The way the optical suggestions of the fracture really resonate with the essentially transitional quality of the piece. Exactly. I would have to disagree. I, I agree that it could be troubling how the internal dynamic of the bimorphic forms verges on codifying the accessibility of the piece. However, I think it's fundamentally a, a very p playful piece and it really invites a participation into the critical dialogue of the 90s. Psst. Hey. Hey, um, I'm really sorry. Do you think you could help me with this? I'm just super confused. I don't know if I missed the class that we like went through this or or if I wasn't paying attention or what, but we did it last Friday. Oh, Friday afternoon. Yeah, I definitely just wasn't paying attention. Friday afternoon's a hard one, man. Um, anyway, what did you get for the first one, for number one? Oh, I was way off. Oh, I see. And how did you get that? Can I just have a look at your notes? Okay, I don't know what I did, but it was not that. And then, for the second one, I got 8.5, but that isn't right either. No, okay, no, that's... Oh, okay, yeah, I don't know, I'm, I'm way off. Okay, so I have here a chart. And just looking at the first circle here, can you tell me what this number is? Good, it's a 12 second. What number is this? Good, it's an 8. And here, what number is this? It's a 6. Good. What number is this? This is a 29. Here, what number is this? This one is a 57. Good. Here, what number is this? Good, a number five. And here, what number is this? The number three, well done. Here, what number is this? Fifteen, well done. Okay, let me think. Um, what outfit were you going to wear tonight? Right, okay. Yeah, so I think let's go for the, like, shimmery pink kind of colour. Just close your eyes. I'm just going to... Okay, perfect. And I'll go in with a slightly darker colour for the, like, outer corner. Okay, close your eyes again. So you see how it's just a, a wooden stick with one end, which is a different colour. Now this one's blue, but sometimes they are red or purple or a different colour. It doesn't matter, they all work the same. So you have to find the end which is a different colour and this is the end which you are going to use to strike against the box. You need to strike it fast and apply some pressure. And this creates friction and also in here and in here are some things which set off a chemical reaction when you create the friction and that's what makes the flame, okay? So you take your end of the match, hold it against the side of the box, and swipe it a few times until it catches fire. Okay, and that's really it. Do you want me to show you again? Okay, so I'm just going to ask you a few questions just to get to know you a little bit better. 
Um, would you consider yourself an introvert or an extrovert? Okay. Do you find it easy or difficult to stay calm under pressure? Do you find it easy or difficult to ask others for help when you need it? Mm -hmm. Do you consider yourself a spontaneous person or do you prefer to have a plan? Mm -hmm. Are you patient or impatient? Yeah, awesome. And do you find it easy or difficult to make new friends? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes, I'm ready. Are you ready? All right. You know I'm not good at drawing. The snowman. All right, I'll do. I'll do another one. Where are the words? Okay, okay. I got one. Okay. So it's like this. You, but this bit. Just tilt your head slightly up for me. Good, let me just. Good, okay, now just face me again. beautiful postcard with some of the wildflowers of Britain. I just want you to look where I point, okay? Can you look at the poppy? Look at the poppy. Look at the chamomile. The chamomile. Look at the dandelion. The dandelion. Good. Look at the foxglove. Foxglove. Look at the bluebell. The bluebell. Good. Look at the buttercup. Buttercup. Look at the dog rose. The dog rose. Look at the cornflower. The cornflower. Look at the white clover. The white clover. Look at the daisy, 